Senator Kolbeck. Thank you very much, Madam President. I arrived with my no vote explanation. Um, when we voted on these bills the first time out in the Senate, I was in the middle of surgery and unable to vote on it. But when I uh, got out from underneath that anesthesia, I was uh, disappointed to find out that we had decided to pursue this policy. Um, this year was a pretty big year. We finally put an end to picking winners and losers via the film credits, and only to find out that now we picked a new industry to go off and provide favored nation status to, and that's the data centers. And I'm all for getting data centers into our state. I'd love to have more and more data centers here. But uh, going off and providing special tax exemptions for them um, is not the way to do it. Data centers, one nice thing about them is that they've got one area in their expense line item that, that uh, is one of the highest expenses that they have as a business, and that is around electricity. You need to power up the servers. You need to keep them cool. I used to offer software as a service in private industry, and I have had my tours of data centers before. If you can find a way to actually lower the expense of that electricity, um, you found a way to go off and provide them with a lower cost of doing business in the state, and you can do it without having a uh, pick and winners and losers tax strategy. That's the path we should be pursuing to lower the cost of doing business in our state, not by providing a special tax exemption. I urge my colleagues to join me with a no vote. I'd like my remarks added to the journal, please. Your remarks will be printed as your no vote explanation.